Hey everyone, History Uncovered here. Today we are going to be metal detecting Old Town Swanee again. It's been a while. Hopefully we can end our silver slump and start getting back into the silver streak. And uh, yeah, without any further ado, let's just go right into it. <laughs> If you guys don't know the side of this house yet, we're back at the dream site where this guy found a walking liberty right there. And down here, I've got a uh, piece of a uh, cap gun. I'm actually very happy about that. I got a wheat, 1956 Denver, like every single wheat pen we pulled out of this yard. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we haven't found our walking liberty yet. Mm -mm. But it's coming coming soon, I hope. This rang up as an 87, and I thought it was going to be a silver dime, but hey, I'll take cool. this too. All right, Love so. Love old cap gun. They always have cool yeah. designs. Yeah, these are, these are cool. Made in the USA. That is how you know it's old. All right. So uh, we'll keep going. Hopefully we uh, have more to show. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure Eli has a wheat. The only reason why we're filming it is because it's just a really nice plug shot. So go ahead and pull her out, see what we got. I'll flip it over. Flip it. That's gotta be a wheat. It looked like a wheat. Yeah, it's a wheat. It's right. slick too. Yeah, it could be another 5016. <laughs> Try and get a date right Hopefully here. Hopefully it's old. I think I wanna say 20, 23, 24. Let me see. We're definitely gonna get a date up there. Let me pause it for a second. No. Okay, guys. We we're back on the silver streak. We got a silver dime here. It's a rosy. Rub that rosy. I'll rub it. I got a rose into Roosevelt. Logan. It's 19... Oh, crap. 1960. Give me some skin. <laughs> All right. And that's silver. I want to, you know... Here you go. Yeah, look. you can play with it a little bit. Rub that really. Rub that really. Arr. Rub it real good. I had to work for this thing. Like, there's a root right here, and I just I'm started on a digging. pretty good si signal. See, this, this showed up as a... Like an 80, 85, 86, like they always do. Nice. Look at that. We're back on the silver. Let's go. All righty, Daddy. So glad to see us getting some I'm silver. so happy. Oh, thank goodness. What is this? The first silver of 2020? Yeah. The first silver of 2020, and it's October. All right, let's go. So uh, Eli just found this uh, chain. What, what can I see it before he starts brushing? Let's take a look at it. Uh, I think it might be Jesus. I think. Pretty this side sure. it has words. This side has words. We're gonna clean it up. We're pretty sure it's uh, what silver plated. Yeah, yeah something like that. probably. Um, something of the highway protect us. Oh yeah, it's definitely a Jesus chain. Yeah, that's Mary. Well, cool. That's cool. I remember I found a chain here before too. That wasn't. How do we miss this? Like I don't know. How do we miss a silver dime? I don't this know. This showed up as an eighty-seven. Some stuff changes, I guess. The ground just moves. But yeah. Oh cool wow, fight. that's really nice. Cool. So we are back from the hunt today. We'll start here with Eli's finds. He got three wheat pennies and this uh, silver plated necklace, which is really neat actually. Uh, it looks like Jesus on the front or something. And then on the back it says, Our Lady of the Highway Protect Us. It's from Italy and that's Pretty sure that's Mary on the back, right, Eli? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, that's pretty neat. We'll go over here with my finds now. Here's my clad. Uh, that could be some sort of winding key. As you see, it's broken there at the bottom. Right there, we've got um, two keys. This one could be old, and this one definitely looks old. Um, shotgun shell. It's a piece of a bottle I found. Uh, looks pretty old. This thing, which I think I might have figured it out, doesn't this look like a um, a bag seal right there? It does. I think it might be a modern bag seal. It does say seal on it, though. Mm -hmm. So it probably is a bag seal. A uh, modern or more modern one. A uh, piece of chipped, uh, napped flint. Two wheats and... A silver dime. It's been a long time. And it's uh, definitely a sight for sore eyes. Yes, it's a 1960, but still silver nonetheless. 
I also found this uh, cap gun part. Looks pretty nice. It's got a nice ornate design on it, as you can see. And uh, I definitely got the good, the good chunk of it. It's got a nice flower on the barrel there. Some deer. Very nice piece of a cap gun. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like. And as always, thank y'all for watching. Happy hunting. And God bless. You just dug a wheat back here, so it's possible. What I'm gonna do, it's so shallow, but the wheat was also like two inches. Right. I'm just gonna. You're just gonna beep it? Yeah, well, there she is. Oh, God. <laughs> and that's gonna go in the bloopers. Bloop, bloop.